the Stairs Conditions race is next. It's a two mile conditions race this time for three year olds. And upwards at the top, we've got Chicago Medic for Padre Hogan, Clipped Bales for Satyam, October Tiger for Graham Closebook, El Paso Jewel, Vinnie Gerard, Lady Macbeth, Leon Van Rensburg, Modern Bell, Craig Beckwith, Star Deli, Alex Sherry, that was back from last season, William Wordsworth for Paul Rhodes, and Louise for Matt Cooper. So nine of them then this time. Ready to go, and away they go. It's a very level break. It's going to be William Wordsworth who's going to come through to take it. So, Paul Rhodes obviously naming some of his horses after some famous writers this season, as well as famous lady jowling throwers. And it's already got the mixture of those from. Anyway, it's William Wordsworth that's in the lead from Click Bales in second. That's one of Satyam's cricketing. Things. October Tiger is next, one of the Graham Clutterbuck October horses, probably back from last season, and then Louise is after that one, and Star Deli, Modern Bell is next, and then Lady Macbeth with the grey El Paso Jewel, just the back marker at this point, but they've got a mile and a half still to go, and William Wordsworth is in the lead. From Chicago, Medic in second on the outside of October Tiger, tucked in behind them is Louise in the red jacket, then comes Clip Bales in the yellow with the black sleeves, right over on the far side of the orange sleeves is Star Deli, Lady Macbeth is the one with the gold cap next to the white cap of Modern Belt, with the back marker being the grey El Paso jewel for Vinnie Gerard. but it's William Wordsworth who's setting the way at the moment, he's in the trail, leads by a good five lengths to October Tiger second, Chicago Medic is back in third, and then Clip Bales and Star Deli. And Louise just dropping back a little bit. Not the balance outside, and Lady Macbeth on the inside. El Paso Jewel, still the back marker, but looks like it's going to be switched wide to come around the outside of the rest of them. They hit the final mile then now. And William Wordsworth is clearing the lead with only by three now. So October Tiger in second. Chicago Medic is back in third, and then Modern Bell and Star Deli with Clip. Bales after that one, and then El Paso Jewel is now making a forward move. Louise is after that one, and now Lady Macbeth has been relegated to the back spot. But it's William Wordsworth who continues to lead by a length or so to October Tiger in second. Gap back to Chicago Medic and Star Deli is now making a forward move. Then Modern Bell wide on the track, El Paso Jewel. Then after that one, Clip Bales and Louise with Lady Macbeth a bit trapped in there at the back. Leon so has got nowhere to go at the moment. There's still four and a half furlongs to go, though, so time to get it out. Looks like he's got a split now if he can take it. But it's William Wordsworth who's too clear of October Tiger in second. And then Star Deli. El Paso Jewel is next to them. Modern Bell. Then comes Chicago Medic. Gap then to Clip Bales and Lady Macbeth. And finally Louise, but it's William Wordsworth. William Wordsworth is too clear of the grey. El Paso Jewel into the final three. From Star Deli and October Tiger, then Modern Bell gap back to Chicago Medic. Difficult to see Lady Macbeth winning it from there, but it's William Wordsworth who's in the lead by two. From El Paso Jewel, who's now throwing down a big charge on the outside. Also, Modern Bell's coming out of the pack. And all of a sudden, William Wordsworth gives way. And it's El Paso Jewel who's gone on. From Modern Bell in second. Then comes October Tiger. After that one, is Star Deli and William Wordsworth. They're coming down inside the final half. Along there, and it's El Paso Jewel for Vinnie Gerard in the lead. From Modern Bell who's trying to close. El Paso Jewel needs a line to come. Modern Bell's getting closer. El Paso Jewel takes it. Modern Bell second. October Tiger third. Then Star Deli and Chicago Medic. Lady Macbeth may have been a bit unlucky, but he's left a lot to do didn't do it basically but it's El Paso Jewel that takes it for Vinnie Gerard, Modern Bell for Craig Beckwith was second, October Tiger for Graham Clutterbuck was third, Chicago Medic Patrick Hogan fourth and Star Deli for Alex Cherry was fifth